On the agenda for today is post office, car tag, glasses, God knows what else. Technically today's my day off, but like you on my day off, I have to go do errands. So follow me, we're gonna see what it's like a day in my life. Kind of boring, but I'll teach you some life lessons along the way. Alright, it's Aaron Day, and look who has the privilege of going with me. Say hello. Uh -huh. What's all that racket? You probably hear this on my broadcast. On my broadcasts. It's lame. I think I found the culprit. <laughs> Box 30563 Fort Lauderdale, Florida 33303. You hear me say that every morning on Mornings with the Holy Spirit prayer calls. And this is me getting my mail. We just got it on Saturday. And today is Monday. But we've got some mail here. And look. Da -da -da, a package. I love packages. Woo. Empanadas. All right, let's go get the package. Hallelujah. You know what I love about the ministry is we're reaching people of all ages, all ethnicities, all nationalities, and they send mail from all over the world, not just email, but I love the physical mail. And the package is just about here. I'm gonna do a whole vlog one day on just the packages. But I just had to open this one now. And I'm a sucker for mail. I love getting mail. And this is from, oh, this is from Prophet Jamila. Look, you get the, ooh. Now check this out. This is from her throne room university. This is nice. Look at this, I got a journal. I think some dreams are going in there. Her book, Before the Throne, how about that? This is a good book, worshipers get this. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, come on now, look at this. Now I gotta watch it because there's a certain prophet whose name starts with V that's gonna try to steal this from us, so. Nay, nay. We have a winner. We have a winner. So you two of these. We have a winner. That was the easiest time I've ever had picking out glasses in my life. I hate picking out glasses. I hate wearing glasses. But if you gotta wear some glasses, you might as well wear it. These are cool, man. Wait till you see me at the next conference. You know, I thought what better place than to talk about the new company of Sears than right here at Lens Crafters. You know, God has made you to see. He's created you with spiritual sight. You have eyes, eyes of your heart, just like you have natural eyes. We recently launched the School of the Sears, and I want to give you an opportunity to be part of this groundbreaking company of Sears. Just go to ignitenow.org slash company of Sears. Check it out. I want to see Sears rise up in Jesus' name. It's one of my favorite places. It's Aaron Day, nutrition. I don't, I don't like to cook. <laughs> I don't like cooking. I don't have time for it. I'm traveling all the world, preaching the gospel. Ain't nothing wrong. With, <laughs> ain't nothing wrong with right. Pastor Sierra's little two hands. Oh, I agree. She should cook for you. Well, ain't nothing wrong with your hands either. There. <laughs> now, 
see, this is my food for the week. Take a close look. We have our mushrooms, our spaghetti sauce, fermented food. Fermented food, yes. Organic riced cauliflower, kale with Brussels sprouts. A lot of pre-prepared stuff because I don't have time. Oh, nom, 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 nom. 70% dark chocolate all the way. A few other things in there. I'm healthy. I'm a lean, mean fight machine. You should be too. You should You should just be as lean and mean as, as me and kind of like fucking with us. What? <laughs> So now the, how do you say that, Coupe de Resistance? How do you say that? Now the grand finale. <laughs> yeah, that. Me being more French than whatever language it was I was attempting to butcher, is a new coffee place. We're always looking for new coffee places. We just passed our old favorite, which is not our favorite because it's too hot. Uh, but we're going to a new coffee place, so we will uh, share our coffee experience with you. So I want to give you a little taste of my neighborhood. I'm not going to tell you where it is because I'll have impromptu guests visiting my house to check out some of the wall art and the graffiti. And I live in a very uh, urban area in South Florida where there's lots of just uh, very cool things and also kind of some strange things like, well, like this right here. Now, I don't know about you, but I don't want to drive around in a hearse, amen? Coffee was no bueno. Actually, the coffee wasn't bad, but the, it was a cupita. It was a teeny little itsy bitsy cup. We don't play. We, we, we get enough of that when we go to Europe. We love Europe, but we don't like the teeny weeny itsy bitsy cups. And it was very sterile in there. And we like a boisterous, boisterous atmosphere. Yes. Amen. So that was my errand day. That's what, one of the things I do on my day off. I'd like to do something a little more exciting, but uh, that is life. That is a day in the life of moi. You didn't get to see my morning prayer call, but join me, join me on the morning prayer call. You know, God wants to change your life. God wants to change your life through the power of prayer and perseverance. And I want to encourage you, whatever you're going through today, you know, I goof around a lot. I was having a good time. Whatever you're going through, whatever you're walking through, whatever trial, whatever fire, prayer changes things. And I would encourage you to, to get around people, get around a friend, process, pray, talk it out, get it off your chest, whatever you're dealing with, cast your cares on the Lord. We want to be carefree in the spirit, heavyweight in the spirit in terms of the one-two punch against the devil, but carefree in terms of the load that we bear. We want to cast our cares on the Lord, and we do that through prayer. So I hope you enjoyed the day in the life, the air and day. Nothing too exciting, but you get to see sort of uh, what I do, and I'm not preaching, praying, and prophesying in cities around the world. You guys have a great day. Let me pray for you actually right now. Father, the name of Jesus, I thank you that you uh, cause us even now to cast our cares upon you. Lord, give us uh, your burdens. Help us to make a divine exchange right now. Our burdens for your burdens, because your yoke is easy and your burden light in Jesus name. Listen guys, have a great, great day. I'll be back with you on the other side.